Two Nation, what's going on? It's your boy, Big Big. Welcome back to my black universe. Long overdue. I know, I know, I know. So let's get into it. I know you were looking at like, what the? That was an entertainer. So this is my Jamaican black cast, but let me explain it to you. Okay, so it comes in a glass container. If you look at the, the video where I did the unpackaging or unboxing, if you will. And it's a beautiful glass container. Dope, compact, you can hold in hand and all that stuff. I may have one night in the dark, went to the restroom. Tipsy, knocked it down. So I was broken, to joint to care, went to bed. Woke up that morning, had to clean bottle of glass, but I wouldn't hit the way this product. So I just moved it to a Rubbermaid container and we just keep popping. So let's talk about this beautiful stuff right here. Does it work? Can it help? It helped my beard. Do I use it on my scalp? Sometimes, not consistently. I've, for the most part, given up on trying to save this, salvage this in any way. It'd be cool, but then I have to start going to the barbershop again, and I've gotten away from there for, for many years, taking myself, waiting to get a haircut, or using the new Booksy app. Well, it's not new to some of you guys. It's new to me because I don't go to the barbershop. I just work on my beard. Now, you're looking at my beard, and you're saying, wait a minute, how does it help? Your beard is not as long as it used to be. It is not. I actually did do a beard trim. I trimmed down the length because I want to shape it up a certain way. I'll take this Evan Alexander. If you look, it's a little dry this evening. Just a little bit. It's the night. It's like almost two in the morning. So it's past time for me to put the product on it and go to bed. But if you look, I have it shaped a certain way. And that's what I was looking for. Because it was growing, it was bushy, and it was just looking weird. Like really long up here, but then not as long and not as thick down here. And I want to change the way it grew in. So sometimes you have to put in that work and teach your beard and tell it, I'm your master. Here you go. Now, with that being said, when my beard was growing and I was using the product along with the, not caused by nature, but my uh, G for Men kit, it did help my beard. I feel my beard was starting to get like a little curly, a little thicker in the follicles. And I liked it because it was giving me a certain look. And I stopped using it for a while. And um, I still retained that look, but it started going out a lot more, like I said, up here. And I didn't like that look, so here we are the way it looks. Can it help your beard? I believe it can. Will it absolutely have your beard flourishing and growing? Uh, that depends on a number of factors. DNA depends on your diet. Do you drink a lot of water? Do you eat a lot of fruits and veggies? Uh, do you eat a lot of fruits and vegetables? Do you uh, consume a lot of candy and cake and all kind of crap that can stifle the growth of your beard or your the growth of your, or the health of your body altogether? Yes, you can. You can take uh, biotin pills to so you blue in the face, but if your body, if your DNA is not beard friendly, you're really beating a dead horse and you feel all these little patchy little areas from my understanding. Two, uh, if you take biotin pills and you have a bad diet, your body's not going to process biotin uh, the same way if you have a, uh, you eat cleaner. So, it's, it, it all depends on you and how you, you go about it. I think it's a great product to invest in. Yes, if you're trying to get your best stick as possible and you don't necessarily want to use, uh, take pills or buy a really expensive kit, 30 bucks, uh, that lasts a long time. It's just, it will last me even longer. Uh, you know, even if I was using it consistently, I think I still probably have a month left from the time I uploaded the first video, which I want to say is about two and a half months, maybe even three months ago. I'll throw a card up here somewhere. And uh, it's dope. And um, I need to check them out for more products. Uh, I actually have several products for my daughter. I'm supposed to be getting some stuff for my wife here soon. So uh, I was looking to see if I had it close by, and I don't. But it's all good, man. So Daddy Butters, Daddy's Butter Jamaican Black Castle Butter is absolutely uh, a good product. I like the custom service of that company as well so it's a win-win situation in that respect and um it can help you out just to make an assessment for yourself and make a good purchase so with that being said like share come subscribe and i know it's been too long i apologize man you know putting in work you see the other videos up and it still smells like uh jamaican black cast butter uh, and it's uh i'm not you see i care about the product i put it in a whole different container like share come subscribe until next time please some blessings i say